Hans Werner Balling first wrote about the Balling method way back in 1994 in Dots magazine in Germany. He did a small revision in 1996 and ever since then it's been the number one preferred way to maintain calcium and alkalinity in a balanced way in reef aquariums in Europe. Tropic Marin is the only company that makes Balling products under the direct supervision of Hans Werner Balling. For a more detailed explanation of exactly how the Balling method works, visit our website www.tropic-marin.com. The Tropic Marin Balling Method solutions come in three parts, A, B, and C. They come in one liter bottles as a liquid, or you can get them in the powdered form, which is more economical, and mix it into RODI water yourself. In order to make these solutions, you would take 12 scoops of the Part A powder and mix it into one gallon of RODI water. You would also take 16 scoops of the Part B powder and mix it into a different one gallon of RODI water. And then you would take four scoops of the Part C powder and mix it into yet a different one gallon solution of RODI water. That will result in the three balling solutions. You take those three solutions that you make and you put them into a three-part dosing chamber. You're going to run this three-part dosing chamber through a dosing pump like this and put a different solution, A, B, and C, on each channel. One of the big advantages of the balling method is that because the calcium and the alkalinity are separated into the two different solutions, A and B. You have control over how much calcium and how much alkalinity you add. Keep in mind that even though the part C is mostly magnesium and trace elements, you are not supplementing magnesium trace elements with the, B, with the part C. You're just adding the magnesium and trace elements to balance the sodium chloride that is created as a result of adding the A and B. So if you need to adjust the amount of calcium or the amount of alkalinity going into your tank, you can change the dosage. Originally you're going to start with equal parts of A, B, and C. If you notice that your alkalinity is dropping off a little bit, you can turn up your part B a little bit so that you're adding a little bit more alkalinity to the system. Keep in mind that if you change the amounts of A and B that you're adding, you want the part C to be put in the same amount as the smaller of the A and B. So let's say you're adding 100 milliliters of A, B, and C to the tank. You need to turn your part B up to 120 milliliters. You would add 100 milliliters of A, 120 milliliters of B, and 100 milliliters of C. Lastly, keep in mind that again, even though your part C has the magnesium and the trace elements, you're not supplementing anything, you're balancing that sodium chloride from A and B. So you still wanna use Tropic Marin A and K for your trace elements and the Tropic Marin Biomagnesium to add any additional magnesium that you might need in your system.